Did you learn the ocarina song from Saria? That's a bit of a personal question, first off, and I'll thank you not to ask that. That was a secret moment between her and I. Greetings and salutations, everybody! My name is Chris Bradonsky, and welcome back to Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. So in the last video, we did learn the Ocarina song from Saria, but we're not going to tell this fucker that. Because that was a secret moment that he shouldn't have butted in on. Didn't even know he was watching, the motherfucker. He said has some mysterious power. There may be some other mysterious songs like that that, I, that you can learn higher room. Shut up. I'm tired of listening to people talk. I want to kill things. Things that are worth killing, not those things like in the last episode. You want to hear what I said again? No, not really. You can fuck off permanently now. I need you for so few things. Telling me constantly how to check the map on in the in the sub screen and shit. I don't need you to tell me how to do that. I got it, bro. If you'll excuse me, I'm going to Death Mountain. Woo! No damage. So now there should be nothing impeding my foot traffic through Kokiri, no, Kakariko Village to Death Mountain and speaking with um, what's his face? Uh, I hate skeletons. I hate skeletons. <laughs> they're worse than skeletons. In the case that they're more annoying. Yeah, yeah, very scary. Fuck off. Oh god, that actually reminds me. <laughs> I should have named my character Lunk. <laughs> I just remembered. Rika, Syndigo, and Happy. No, no, no. Uh, my bad. Cyanide and Happiness. Short. I can't remember what it was called, but it was basically like... It was Legend of Zelda, but if, like, Link was this really huge buff dude... Who was, like, just like, don't take shit from nobody. And his name was Lunk. I can't remember exactly what happened, but my god, it was hilarious. And at the end of it... He was frowning the whole time, and he was beating people with an old man instead of a sword. Oh my god. It was so... Fucking funny. <laughs> I was yawning, I'm sorry. Oh hey, look, it's this gloomy-ass dude. Hey. People are disgusting, my own father and mother are disgusting. You must be disgusting, too. Because you look pretty disgusting yourself, motherfucker. How about I cut you? How about I slice your chest open? Bitch. I'm sorry. That was too much. Also, I love the fact that Navi just fucking disappears into my head sometimes. That's great. Probably gives me an aneurysm and shit. Really, it's closed beyond this point. Can't you read the sign over there? I see you're just a kid. You can't read yet. Ha 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 ha. Hey, bitch, read this. Motherfucker. <laughs> <clears throat> this is Link. He is under my orders to save Hyrule. Wa ha ha ha. Wario, is that you? Is this you before you? Before you became fat and stupid? Oh my god! Guys! This is how... This is... This is just as much Wario's origin story as it is the Legend of, of... Of... You know, Zelda. Oh my god! This guy is Wario! I've never heard anybody else start a laugh with wah! I mean, I'm sure maybe I have, but... Like, that's... Whatever, shut up. I should give you a special discount. Oh my god. 
Just get out of my way! Please? No! I don't have to. And quite frankly, I don't want to. The only reason I'll ever even go back is to buy a shield. And quite frankly, I don't think I need to because I think there's a shop in Goron Village, whatever it's called. I don't fucking know. Ugh. I hate how much fucking text there is in this game. Now, don't get me wrong, it's great for, like, exposition, but the fact is, like, people talk too much. I want to get things done. Chop off your arms and your legs, bitch. Fuck. I got his nuts. And not a single heart was dropped out of any one of them. Fuck you too. Nope, I can't deal with you because if you hit me again, I'm gonna die. Bitch ass spiders. Ugh. I don't know why, but like real life spiders don't bug me that much. Like seriously, somebody will be like, oh look spider, and I'll just freaking... <laughs> I just one punch man it, to be honest with you. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I recently got into another anime after finishing No Game No Life. Uh, One Punch Man. It was like, it, it, I saw so many references and stuff to it, and people were like, oh my god, Sajima kicked Goku's ass, and I was just kind of like, oh, allow me to watch this so I can tell you differently, and after I watched it, I was kind of like, oh my god, this dude fucking slap Goku and kill him. This is insane. This has never happened before. And it is like the weirdest thing ever. Oh, gonna hit that with my head. And now I need my ocarina. Yes, safe place. Okay, uh, how did it go? I think that was it. Yeah, that was it. Okay, good. Yay! Fuck out of my way. And here's this dude. The only Goron with a beard. What the heck? Who are you? When I heard the song of the royal family, I expected their messenger had arrived. But you're just a little kid. Has Darunia, the big boss of the Goron, finally lost so much status that he's treated like this by his sworn brother, the king? Now I'm really angry. Get out of my face now. Are you asking why I'm in such a bad mood right now? Into creatures, we've been harvest and starvation, but this, we... Okay. Allow me to brighten you up with a little song I learned. Shit, how does it go? That's not it. I love that sound. Duh. It's like, you fucked up. Nope, that's not it either. Hold on, pal. I'll get it. There we go. Cannot for the life of me ever remember which direction it is. And now he's like, oh shit, this is my jam. He is fucking pumped. Oh! Oh, oh! Come on! Come on, come on, come on! What are you, fucking Elvis? Hot! What a hot beat! Woo! Yeah! Yahoo! Hey, what a nice tune. Just like that, my depression is all gone. Something just came over me. I suddenly wanted to dance like crazy. I am Darudio. I'm the big boss of the Gorons. Was there something you wanted to ask me about? What? You want the spiritual stone of fire, too? The 
The spiritual stone of fire, also known as the Goron's Ruby, is our race's hidden treasure. Well, if I know about it, it's not that hidden now, is it? Definition of hidden meaning it is somewhere where nobody knows where it is. But hold on. I'm not going to give it to you that easily, if you want it so badly. Why don't you go destroy the monsters inside of the Dongo's Cavern and prove you're a real man? Or I could just chop my trousers and show you my dingle. I'm a real man. Fuck bitches constantly. I apologize for that. That's the first time I've ever uttered that phrase in this. I apologize. I think that was a little too much. You got the Goron's race, and now you can pull up bomb flowers, stand next to one. Yay! So, everybody, that's it for this episode of Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. I apologize once again for saying that a few moments ago. That was a bit too much. But you know what? It needed to be said. <laughs> but I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you have any comments or questions, be sure to leave them down below. If you like this video, maybe leave a like. And if you're not subscribed already, maybe consider clicking subscribe. You know that little red button over there? You know, right there? Little button? You click clicky you know help me out and I will see all of you lovely people in the next video bye bye